the Fed did not cut interest rate. What do you think is going to happen if they do, ladies and gentlemen? What do you think is going to happen? This is great news, okay? That means that the housing market is, is on a head-on collision with a full-on crash. And that means there's a great opportunity for you and me. If you're interested in real estate, check out my site, myrealestatedojo.com. Anyways, I've been predicting that we're going to have a 19% mortgage rates uh, for a couple of moons now, okay? And a lot of people think it's not possible. I don't know if you look at in history of America, there was a one point we had 17% mortgage rates, okay? In America, 18% mortgage rates, okay? It's not that far away. If you look at in America, a few years ago, like 2016, gold prices were $1,100. Today, they're south of $2,400, guys, okay? They've literally doubled plus, okay? Um, you're having um, massive leaders being, you know, somehow executed or attempted execution or they're disappearing from the Iranian all the way down to the American government attempt, all the way down to other countries that have this exact thing. There's already been three top leaders that has happened to, but no one was really talking about it. At the same time, we're having you know, major kinetic energy, what's going on in the Middle East is just going up higher and higher, higher, okay? So this is, is, is a playing sig signal that we're, we're in the middle of the conflict. The heat, is a, the heat is being turned up, and that just means that the suffering is just starting. This, there is no bailout. The bailout came in the pandemic when everyone was sitting at home and the government was giving everyone free money saying sit at home and just shop that was the bailout there was over 7.7 .7 million people they're in default in their homes and we stopped the foreclosure process okay there is no more bailout okay <laughs> this is the time we have to pay the reaper now a lot of us think that the fed can help out here and there but it really can as i had been talking about in my videos for so many um years is that the dollar is in the, on the verge of collapse, okay? Um, there are so many forces making it, trying to collapse that is unbearable. Um, from, you know, conflicts that we're having to wars to so many different things. So, you know, in my opinion, this is a great time to be alive because we're in a recession. I always say the recession, the depression, whatever you want to call it, whatever is the hip term today, uh, is your friend. <clears throat> So, depression, the recession is my friend, and I hope it's your friend too. If you think that it's your friend and you need uh, some coaching or some consulting for your business, or you need the, the uh, do it yourself course of the books on how to find off market property uh, with very little marketing budget and negotiate seller financing or owner financing, then go to myrealestatedojo.com. So what I suspect is that interest rates will continue and continue uh, going up. We may have some, you know, cuts here and there, but, you know, there's, there's, they've already done all they can do. You know, we have 0% interest rates. We have free money printing. Uh, you know, if you Google into today, what is the uh, inflation rate today? Google will tell you 3%. But you and I know that is way, 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 that number is cooked. Uh, if you just go to your grocery store, you know what I mean. Uh, so great times are coming. You know, I, I don't want to be sounding negative, even though, you know, so many people are having hard times but because they're getting laid off. Um, a lot of people that are on fixed mortgages or I'm sorry, uh, fixed incomes like retirees are having hard times. And, and, and you know, and I know. It's not easy, but one thing that we have to understand is we have to turn off the, the media. We have to realize that, you know, that the guy upstairs is going to provide for us no matter what. And that we have to just be our dreams. And, you know, and, and as the, as that one coach says, all we can do is all we can do. And, and that's it, guys. If you, if you give it all you got, 
that's all that matters, man. You know what I mean? And But for me, in my house, I believe that today is one of the best time to be a real estate investor. It's the best time to be an entrepreneur if you want to buy businesses, if you want to buy even a consumer. It's a good time to be a consumer. Uh, not only buying from factories brand new, but also negotiating for motivated sellers like I talked to you guys about uh, a lot of bicycle flip deals that I have done recently that I bought like literally three thousand five thousand dollar bikes which is a couple hundred bucks anyways if you're interested in the bicycle thing go to the new flip.com learn all the skills you need for real estate investing while making money today if you have any questions comment leave it below but i don't think the fed's going to cut the prices guys on interest rate i think we're heading up to the moon there may be a couple of dips here and there but we're just rocketing you know because the dollar's in trouble if they keep cutting the world is already turning its back on the dollar there are a lot of people trying to invest into the stock market from around the world because they think this is the safest place but they don't know what's kicking anyways guys love to hear your thought i think this is the best time to be alive because of all the opportunities and major discounts in real estate in commercial and so on love to hear your thoughts below peace